All right, hey everyone. Okay, so welcome back to another Bad Mechanic News Update video and uh Wow. So anyway, that's a thing. Yeah, so anyway, guys, welcome back to uh, another news update video. And yeah, um, <laughs> what is going on? We're getting news announcements every day. We're getting news announcements literally every second of every day right now. So what is it that's just happened? Well, you know South by Southwest, that really cool convention that happens in America? It's kind of become the like um, unofficial Sonic convention lately. You know, for the last few years, there's been a Sonic panel at the South by Southwest um, convention. No, I'm not sure what kind of convention this is actually. They seem to show everything. There seems to be games, TV, movies, you know, comic books I think are there as well. It's like a giant, it's like a mini comic con, but loads of people go to it. So anyway, South by Southwest or SXSW, I think that's their logo. This logo right here. So yeah, that, that thing, that thing. So you probably know that for the last couple of years, there has been a Sonic panel at this various, at this convention. Now the first time they did this, the panel was a bit, yeah, it wasn't that great. But lately, since that panel, since that panel, the very first panel they did, they have had some kind of really epic news announcement at them. Like, you might remember that this was the panel that they announced Sonic Mania Plus. It was the panel they finally revealed what Sonic Forces was. And I'm pretty sure last year they revealed... Um, do you know what? I can't remember what they revealed last year. What did they remember last year? What did they What did they reveal last year? I think it was Sonic Toys. I think it was um I think it was uh, the, the Jack Specific stuff. Yeah, I'm pretty. I, I want to say that they um, did they tease some of the new um, uh, merchandise there. I think they teased some of the new merchandise there. They, they they did something there. There was something there. I just can't remember what it was. Can't remember what it was, guys. Let me know in the comments what it was that they announced. But I'm sure it was something pretty cool. Everybody was like woo woo woo. And of course, I'm pretty sure this was the panel where we got. This epic, <laughs> this this epic question. If you were to have a crossover between the Sonic games and Batman, <laughs> how would the, how would Sonic be the Joker? <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> well, anyway. So anyway, guys, they have just announced just this second there is going to be a panel at this year's 2020 South by Southwest Expo. It's a new Sonic panel. The panel is called, gotta go fast, the official Sonic the Hedgehog panel. And let's just uh, let's just take a look right now at what they say in the blurb, because, um, you know, sometimes they put clues in there, sometimes they don't. So let's just read that right now and find out. Sonic the Hedgehog is back at SXSW. Special guests from Sega and Sonic Team as they talk about the latest for the Blue Blur and his next steps for 2020 and beyond. There's almost always a special announcement or two to be had, so be sure to stay tuned. Oh, okay, so the cards, the cards, my dear. We're not dealing the cards, no, we're keeping them close to our chests. There are cards in my chest, my dear. Yes, they're keeping their cards close to their chests, so um, yeah, uh, I guess it's time to speculate! Yeah, yeah, let's, let's, let's go into my predictions as to what's actually going to be at this panel. And, ow. Yeah, so, yeah, so let's talk, let's talk about what I think's likely going to be at this panel. So, first of all, I think it's a given that either Aaron Webber or Katie, probably both will be there, because they're like the faces, they're the faces of the community team, and they get out and they're really friendly and they're awesome, and if you see them there, make sure to say hi, because they will say hi back and they will be very nice to you. Plus, Aaron Webber was kicking ass on Twitter, take that, pew, pew, pew! Yeah, that's my only statement on that one. But anyway, that's the thing that happened. So, um, yeah, I, I think it's a given that they will be there. Takashi Izuka is almost certainly gonna turn up. Yeah, I would not be surprised if he's there one bit. But who else is gonna turn up? Hmm, this is a really good question. Kristen Whitehead, maybe he'll be there. I'm not so sure, I think he's working on something else right now. But um, Tyson Hess might be there. It's very likely that he'll be there because have you noticed how Tyson Hess keeps popping up at Sega? Like, um, in the live streams towards the end of last year, did you notice that Titan Tyson Hess was just randomly at Sega even though they weren't doing anything? So I think that's kind of a given. But what else is likely? What is likely to be there? Well, in the past, they've also revealed the Sonic, um, you know, the, the new animation shorts. They've been at those things, so... 
I think it's very possible that we could get a new animation short. I'm not 100%, but they have been very successful. And don't forget, we have seen Tyson has been at Sega every now and again, so I think it's kind of likely that we will get a new animation short, so I think that's very likely. But, what I think is more likely is merch news! Yeah, I think it's, I think it's a given. I think it's an absolute given that we are going to see some uh, news about various merch lines. Like, whether it be Jack Specific, Diamond Select Toys, or, or hell, anybody! I think it's almost certain we are going to see some Sonic merch at this thing. Like, even just a case of, oh yeah, these are some brand new items and they're now available on the Sega shop. Go buy, 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 money, 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 moolah, moolah, moolah. Hey! I should have actually had notes here so I could have thrown it around, but I don't. So anyway, that's that. So I would not be surprised if we get a merch announcement. But the big question, the big question, the number one question, and this is the thing that is going to be on all the clickbait YouTube videos. What is that? Who is that mystery Sonic in the silhouette? Is that a new game announcement? Um, maybe? Are we likely to get a new game announcement at this thing? Now, I know some of you are going to be like, Oh, but they announced Mania Plus at one of these things. That was a new game. Was it though? Yeah, um, I'm not so sure we'll get a game announcement. We might get a tease. We might get a tease. I think if we, I, I, you know, I don't know, I, the, the hype train is well and truly, it's not left the station, but the, but the food trolley is on it, and the passengers are taking their seats, so I think in terms of a game announcement, I think that we might get a tease, I think a tease is almost certain, even if it is literally just Izuka saying, ah, we have some news for you very, very soon. Yeah, I, I think it'll be something like that. I want there to be a game announcement because then I can, um, then I can talk about it, but I, I'm not so sure. I genuinely don't know. I'm not, I'm not sure. I want there to be a game announcement, but I, I genuinely, I genuinely don't know. I generally unsure this time. But um, what else? What else is uh, probably likely? What, what, do we, what do we think? Um, what do we think they're going to announce? I would almost certainly bet that there's going to be some IDW comic news. Yeah, I, I don't think there'll be very much, but I'm pretty sure there'll be something. I would not be surprised as well if we do actually get some kind of big or significant announcement at this event. Now, whether that's a game or not is is a, is another issue, but. I'm pretty sure that we are going to get some kind of big announcement or some kind of, you know, reveal. Might not be a game, but it'll be something kind of significant. Why do you say that, Badnik? Why do you say that? you got no evidence that that's a thing. Why are you saying that? Why are you saying... Why are you getting my hopes to such a high level? Why, why, why are you doing that? You're usually kind of, hey guys, come back down here. It might not be that, but let's think about it. Let's think about it. What could it be? Well, you might remember, uh, like it was a couple of weeks ago now, it was back in January, Sega announced that they were going to reveal or announce some new kind of Sonic news or reveal something significantly interesting on the 20th of each month. Well, look at the date of the panel! It's on the 20th! <gasps> yeah! So, the panel itself falls on the day that Sega say that they were going to- The day that Sega say! Hey, that's a rhyme! The day that Sega say! Hey! <laughs> yeah! So, the panel falls on the date that Sega said they would be revealing new Sonic news. Oh, whoa, it's happening, it's happening! The conductor's on the way to the hype train! Yeah, so I'm pretty sure this means that we are going to get something kind of um, significant there. But whether it's another, whether it's a game announcement or not, is another thing. I would not be surprised if they talk a lot about the movie, given how it will have, it, you know, it's like, how many, how long is it after after that? It's like a month after it's been released, doesn't it? Yeah, February, well, yeah, yeah, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a while after the movie's released. So yeah, they should be able to talk about it if it's good, if it's good, because if it's not good, they will not be talking about it at this thing. But yeah, um. I'm pretty sure that there will be some kind of significant announcement at this thing. Whether it is a game or not is a completely other issue, but I ho I'm hopeful, I'm hopeful. Like, normally if they get Azuka to this thing, then that's kind of the key, because they don't normally take Azuka. <laughs> I'm talking to him as if he's like, just bring out the Azuka! Bring out the Azuka! Bring out the Azuka! That's something for the comments, fill the comments with that! Bring out your Azukas! 
bring out your azookas. They don't usually break azooka. Just put him there very gently. Unless he's got something significant to say, announce, or tease. You know, you could trace this back. Like, they don't usually do that. They, they don't usually do that because they don't... Because Azuka's a busy man! He's very busy doing stuff. He's busy doing the Sonic things. He's busy going, that's why my Sonic must go fast. So yeah, he's busy doing that. You don't bring him unless he's going to be there. Anyway, uh, other clues as well. So when they start announcing the guests, that's usually other clues. Like if they get the person who's like the producer of the various Sonic shorts, you can bet there's going to be an animation announcement. If they get someone who's got something to do with like licensing, you can bet there's going to be merch announcements. So let's keep an eye out on the on the guest list and when there's a, any when there's some more announcements we'll do another video update and then we'll talk about it and we can make some predictions some more accurate predictions then okay guys so keep uh, keep checking out the keep checking out the channel don't forget to click subscribe and the notification button hit the like button and type in the comments bring out the azukas bring out the azukas we want to bring out and also bring out the azukas with the arm wave yeah let's do that Thank you very much for watching, guys. And, oh, will I do a live stream of this? Like a live stream reaction, because that's the thing people do. Maybe, we'll see. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Please, please press the like button. Don't forget to click the subscribe bell notification button. And I will see you again next time. Goodbye.